dear students today chapter 4 class 9th rd sharma algebraic identities we will solve the questions of exercise 4.2 question number first write the following in the expanded form some identities are given we have to write them in expanded form so first part a plus 2b plus c whole square we have to expand this by using the identity since we have the identity a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca by using this identity we can expand this therefore a plus 2b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus 2b whole square plus c square plus 2 a into b 2b plus 2bc 2 into b is equal to 2b into c is equal to c plus 2ca 2 into c into a which is equal to a square plus 2 square 4 b square plus c square plus 2 to the 4 ab plus 2 to the 4 bc plus 2 ca so this is the required expanded form of given a plus 2b plus c whole square part second 2a minus 3b minus c whole square so we can write this so we can write this 2a plus minus 3b plus minus c whole square we can write in this form 2a plus minus 3b plus minus c for making the identity a plus b plus c whole square since identity is a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca this identity we can apply here here a is equal to 2a b is equal to minus 3b and c is equal to minus c substitute this values here therefore 2a plus minus 3b plus minus c whole square is equal to a square means 2a square plus b square means minus 3b whole square plus c square means minus c whole square plus 2ab a is equal to 2a and b is equal to minus 3b plus 2bc b is equal to minus 3b into c is equal to minus c plus 2ca c is equal to minus c and a is equal to 2a simplify this 2 square 4 a square plus minus square plus 3 square 9 b square plus minus c square plus c square plus minus multiplication minus minus 
टू टू जा फोर थ्री जा ट्वेल्व ए बी माइनस ट्वेल्व ए बी दिस माइनस माइनस मल्टीप्लीकेशन प्लस सो टू थ्री जा सिक्स प्लस सिक्स बी सी एंड दिस माइनस प्लस मल्टीप्लीकेशन माइनस टू टू जा फोर सी ए दिस इज द रिक्वायर्ड एक्सपेंशन ऑफ टू ए माइनस थ्री बी माइनस सी होल स्क्वेयर पार्ट थर्ड माइनस थ्री एक्स प्लस वाई प्लस जेड होल स्क्वेयर दिस वी कैन राइट माइनस थ्री एक्स प्लस वाई प्लस जेड होल स्क्वेयर सेंस ए प्लस बी प्लस सी होल स्क्वेयर इज इक्वल टू ए स्क्वेयर प्लस बी स्क्वेयर प्लस सी स्क्वेयर प्लस टू ए बी प्लस टू बी सी प्लस टू सी ए Here a is equal to minus 3x, b is equal to y, and c is equal to z. Apply this identity here. <coughs> Therefore, minus 3x plus y plus z whole square is equal to a square minus means minus 3x whole square plus b square y square plus c square. Z square plus two a minus three x and b y plus two b c two into b is equal to y into c is equal to z plus two c a two into c is equal to z and a is equal to minus three x. Simplify this, which is equal to minus square plus three square nine x square. Plus y square plus z square plus minus multiplication minus three two just six x y plus two y z plus minus multiplication minus two three just six z x. This is the required expansion of <coughs> minus three x plus y plus z whole square. Part fourth m plus 2n minus 5p whole square. This we can write m plus 2n plus minus 5p whole square. We have identity since a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus C square plus two AB plus two BC plus two CA. Therefore, M plus two N plus minus five P whole square is equal to A square means M square. Plus b square means 2n whole square plus c square means minus 5p whole square plus 2ab. A is equal to m and b is equal to 2n plus 2bc. 2 into b is equal to 2n into c is equal to minus 5p plus 2ca. 2 into c is equal to minus 5p. Into a is equal to m, which is equal to m square plus two square four n square minus square plus five square twenty five p square plus two two is a four m n plus minus multiplication minus minus two two is a four five is a twenty n p. 20 np plus minus multiplication minus minus 2 pipes are 10 pm. So this is the required expansion of m plus 2n minus 5p whole square. Part fifth, 2 2 plus x minus 2y whole square. 
we can write this 2 plus x plus minus 2y whole square here we can apply the identity a plus b plus c whole square is equal to <coughs> a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca here a is equal to 2b is equal to x and c is equal to minus 2y therefore 2 plus x plus minus 2y whole square is equal to a square 2 square plus b square x square plus c square means 2y whole square plus 2ab a is equal to 2 and b is equal to x plus 2bc b is equal to x and c is equal to minus 2y plus 2ca 2c is equal to minus 2y and a is equal to 2 which is equal to 2 square 4 plus x square plus minus square plus 2 square 4y square plus 2 to the 4x this plus minus multiplication minus 2 to the 4xy this plus minus multiplication minus 2 to the 4 to the 8 minus 8y this is the required expanded form of 2 plus x minus 2y whole square part 6 a square plus b square plus c square whole square so we can apply the identity here since a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca so therefore a square plus b square plus c square whole square is equal to a square a square whole square plus b square b square whole square plus c square c square whole square plus 2ab 2 into a square into b square plus 2bc 2 into b square into c square plus 2ca 2 into c square plus a square which is equal to a square whole square a raised to the power 4 plus b square square b raised to the power 4 plus c raised to the power 4 plus 2a square b square plus 2b square c square plus 2c square a square this is the required expanded form of a plus a square plus b square plus c square whole square part 7 <coughs> ab plus bc plus c a whole square so since we have identity a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca therefore ab plus bc plus ca whole square is equal to a square means ab whole square plus b square so bc whole square plus ca whole square plus 2ab so ab into bc plus 2bc bc into ca plus 2ca ca into ab which is equal to a square b square plus b square c square plus c square a square plus 2 a b square c 2 a b square c plus 2 b c c a a b c square a b c square plus 2 c a into a b a square b c a square b c 
this is the required expanded form of ab plus bc plus ca whole square part 8 x upon y plus y upon z plus z upon x whole square so apply the identity a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca here a is equal to x upon y b is equal to y upon z and c is equal to z upon x therefore x upon y plus y upon z plus z upon x whole square is equal to x upon y whole square plus y upon z whole square plus z upon x whole square plus 2ab 2 into x x upon y into b is equal to y upon z plus 2bc plus 2bc b is equal to y upon z into c is equal to z upon x plus 2ca c is equal to z upon x and a is equal to x upon y which is equal to x square upon y square plus y square upon z square plus z square upon x square plus this y y cancelled 2x upon z 2 2x upon z plus here this z z cancelled 2y upon x plus this xx cancelled 2z upon y 2z upon y this is the required expanded form of x upon y plus y upon z plus z upon x whole square part 9th a upon bc plus b upon ac plus c upon ab whole square so apply the identity a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca here a is equal to a upon bc b is equal to b upon ac and c is equal to c upon ab therefore a upon bc plus b upon ac plus c upon ab whole square is equal to a upon bc whole square plus b upon ac whole square plus c upon ab whole square plus 2ab 2 a is equal to a upon bc into b is equal to b upon a is equal to a upon plus 2 a is equal to a upon bc into b is equal to b upon ac plus 2 bc b is equal to b upon ac and c is equal to c upon ab plus 2 ca 2 plus 2 ca c is equal to c upon ab and a is equal to a upon bc simplify this a square upon b square c square plus b square upon a square c square plus c square upon a square b square plus here this bb cancelled this aa cancelled 2 upon c left so plus 2 upon c into c c square 2 upon c square here 
this C cancelled and this B B cancelled. So 2 upon A square plus 2 upon 2 upon A square plus here this A A cancelled and this C C cancelled. B into B B square 2 upon B square. So this is the required expanded form of A upon BC plus B upon AC plus C upon AB whole square. Part 10th X plus 2Y plus 4Z whole square. So since A plus B plus C whole square identity is equal to A square plus B square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca therefore x plus 2y plus 4z whole square is equal to here a is equal to x b is equal to 2y c is equal to 4z so x square plus 2y whole square plus 4z whole square plus 2ab ax and b is equal to 2y plus 2bc b is equal to 2y or c is equal to 4z plus 2ca c is equal to 4z a is equal to x equal to x square plus 2 square 4y square plus 4 4 is 16 z square plus 2 2 is 4 x y plus 2 2 is 4 4 is 16 y z plus 2 4 is 8 8 z x 8 z x this is the required expanded form of x plus 2 y plus 4 z whole square 2 x minus y plus z whole square this we can write this we can write 2x plus minus y plus z whole square. Here a is equal to 2x, b is equal to minus y or c is equal to z. So we can apply the identity. a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca therefore 2x plus minus y plus z whole square is equal to a square means 2x whole square plus b square means minus y square plus c square means z square plus 2ab a uh, a 2x into b minus y plus 2bc b is equal to minus y and c is equal to z plus 2ca c is equal to z and a is equal to 2x which is equal to 2 square 4x square plus minus square plus y square plus z square plus minus multiplication minus 2 2 is a 4 x y plus minus multiplication minus minus 2 y z and this 2 2 is a 4 x 4 z x plus 4 z x this is the required expanded form of 2 x minus y plus z whole square last part of question number first part 12 this we can write minus 2x plus 3y plus 2z whole square. Here we can apply the identity a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca here a is equal to minus 2x b is equal to 3y c is equal to 2z 
so therefore minus 2x plus 3y plus 2z whole square is equal to a square means minus 2x whole square plus b square means 3y whole square plus 2c square means 2z whole square plus 2ab a is equal to minus 2x b is equal to 3y plus 2bc 2b is equal to 3y and c is equal to 2z plus 2ca c is equal to 2z and a is equal to minus 2x which is equal to minus square plus 2 square 4x square plus 3 square 9y square plus 2 square 4z square plus minus multiplication minus 2 2 the 4 3 the 12xy 2 3 the 6 2 the 12yz plus 12yz and plus minus multiplication minus 2 2 the 4 2 the 8zx so this is the required expansion of minus 2x plus 3y plus 2z whole square question number second if a plus b plus c is equal to 0 and a square plus b square plus c square is equal to 16 so find the value of a b plus b c plus c a here a plus b plus c is given a plus b plus c is equal to 0 a square plus b square plus c square is equal to 16 so we have to find out the value of a b plus b c plus c a is equal to question mark this we have to find out so for finding this a b plus b c plus c a just apply the identity a plus b plus c whole square since a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca here we can substitute the values which implies a plus b plus c 0 0 square a square plus b square plus c square is given 16 this is 16 put this 16 plus from here take out two common two common so this is ab plus bc plus ca 0 square 0 shift this 16 this side minus 16 is equal to 2 ab plus bc plus ca minus 16 divide by this 2 by cross multiplying ab plus bc plus ca 2 we can cancel this 2 8 just 16 so minus 8 therefore ab plus bc plus ca is equal to minus 8 this is the required value of ab plus bc plus ca minus 8 question number third if a square plus b square plus c square is equal to 16 and a b plus b c plus c a is equal to 10 then find the value of a plus b plus c so a square plus b square plus c square is equal to 16 given and a b plus b c plus c a is equal to 10 given so find the value of a plus b plus c is equal to question mark so for finding a plus b plus c we can apply the identity a plus b plus c whole square then we can substitute this two values this and this so we can get this so since a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca now here this a plus b plus c whole square is equal to 
substitute this a square plus b square plus c square is equal to 16 from here this is 16 plus take out two common from last three terms so this is a b plus b c plus c a now we can substitute a b plus b c plus c a is equal to 10 which implies a plus b plus c whole square is equal to 16 plus 2 into 10 which implies a plus b plus c is equal to 16 plus 10 to the 20 which implies a plus b plus c whole square is equal to 16 plus 20 36 take a square root of both sides so this is a plus b plus c is equal to plus minus 6 when we take the square root of both sides then we have to substitute one side plus minus both sign because the square of positive 6 is 36 and negative 6 square is also 36 so we have to take both the side plus minus 6 this is the required value of a plus b plus c plus 6 or minus 6 question number 4 if a plus b plus c is equal to 9 and a b plus b c plus c a is equal to 23 find the value of a square plus b square plus c square so write this given a plus b plus c is equal to 9 a b plus b c plus c a is equal to 23 so find the value of a square plus b square plus c square is equal to question mark so for finding this a square plus b square plus c square apply the identity a plus b plus c whole square since a plus b plus c whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca substitute values a plus b plus c whole square and value of a plus b plus c is given 9. So 9 square is equal to this a square plus b square plus c square we have to find out. So write as it is plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca take out 2 common 2ab plus bc plus ca 9 square 81 a square plus b square plus c square plus 2 a b plus b c plus c a is equal to 23 which implies 81 is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 23 to the 46 shift, shift 46 in left side so 81 minus 46 is equal to a square plus b square plus c square so a square plus b square plus c square we can write a square plus b square plus c square is equal to 11 minus 6 5 and 7 minus 4 3 35 so 35 is the required value of a square plus b square plus c square so i think it's enough for today the remaining questions of this exercise we will solve in next class okay bye